Okay, in this video, we're going to take a look at monopolistic competition in the short run, but we're going to discover something different. And that is, it's going to turn out that this firm is going to be incapable of producing in the short run. That is, it's going to have to shut down. So I'm kind of giving away the answer before we even get underway, but that's okay. All right, let's figure out why that's the case. Well, remember, the first thing you got to do is ask yourself is, is MR equal to MC? It certainly is. It's equal to uh, it's equal to each other right here where my red arrow is. Where would the price be? Well, that would be up here at the demand curve. So that would be a product price of $8. Now, the question we have to ask ourselves is, is this an operating profit? And the answer is no. And why is that? Because this price is not above the average variable cost. It's actually below the average variable cost. So the firm is actually making an operating loss of a dollar a unit times 100 units. That rectangle right there is a $100 loss. In fact, let's go ahead and shade it in. All right. That is the operating loss. Now, of course, the economic loss is even worse. But the bottom line is firms don't produce in the short run if they can't make an operating profit. So operating losses are not acceptable. And in fact, the economic losses are even more, uh, are even worse than this because the price is actually below the average total cost, which is on the blue line. In any event, this firm would be much better off not producing at all. Now, the question is, how much would the firm lose uh, if it actually uh, produced in the first place. Well, let's go ahead and come up with some number for what average total cost would look like. So I'm draw a vertical dotted line. Whoops, let me erase that. Let me draw a vertical dotted line going upwards to grab a point on the average total cost curve, okay? And now we'll go to the left. And then I'm going to make an estimate as to what that price will be. My bet would be that's about $12. So let's go ahead and write $12. So remember the price is 8 The average total cost is 12 It would actually be losing $4 a unit if it produced. And that would be a total economic loss of $400 if it actually produced. All right, now, the question that you have to ask yourself is, what are the average fixed costs? Well, if the average total cost is $12 and the average variable cost is $9 right here, that's $3 of average fixed cost. If it shut down, Take that $3 of average fixed cost and multiply it times 100. That's a total fixed cost of 300. So the, the question you've got to ask yourself is, does it make more sense to shut down and lose 300 or produce and lose 400? That's easy to answer. Shut down and only lose 300 rather than make matters worse and add to your losses. All right, that's pretty much it for this video. Take care and best wishes and until next time.